visitors to Zhuo Qingji Airport can enjoy a free exhibition that documents how the late Mr. Lee Kuan Yew made Qingji Airport the world-class aviation hub it is today. The Exhibition To mark Mr. Lee's 100th birth anniversary, will run from Saturday to September 30th at Cloud 9 Piazza, located at level 5 of Jewel Chingji Airport. It will move to another location at the airport after October. Featuring six interactive zones, the courage to dream, the making of the Chingji Airport story is an immersive exhibition with rarely seen archival documentary footage, interactive storytelling screens, and sensory exhibits. Tracing the history of aviation in Singapore, visitors will begin their journey by traveling back to the 1970s to learn about the history of Paya Lebar Airport. A life-size living room set and realistic auditory effects help take them back in time, so they can experience the inconveniences of living in central Singapore with aeroplanes flying over them back then. An audio clip of the historical moment of the first ever mention of Chingji during Mr. Lee's speech to a crowd at Katong Community Center in 1970 is also featured here. The next chapter follows the struggles behind Mr. Lee and his team's decision to move the country's airport to Chingji Airport. When the pace of air traffic growth outstripped that of Paya Liba Airport's capacity, visitors can play with an interactive digital screen to better understand significant trade-offs of the move. They are then guided through Mr. Lee's deliberations during key events in the 1970s, like the oil crisis and his decision to convene a committee to construct two runways at Chingji. Through archival footage and news articles. Additionally, for the first time ever, the signed cover page of the Special Committee on Airport Development final report, which gave the green light for the development of Chingji Airport, is available for public viewing. Visitors can also enjoy a short film of rarely seen archival documentary videos of the construction of Terminal 1, which opened in July 1981 and listen to first-hand interviews with pioneering airport leaders. Personal anecdotes of Mr. Lee's vision for Qingji are featured, some of which include his vested interest in adding greenery to the airport, keeping its toilets as clean as possible, and eliminating queues. Lastly, visitors are encouraged to explore the future of Singapore's aviation by looking ahead to the Qingji East development and the upcoming Terminal 5. At a media launch on Friday, Mr. Jason Goh, Executive Vice President of Airport Management at Qingji Airport Group, said Mr. Lee's decision to relocate Singapore's airport from Paya Lebar to Qingji was a pivotal moment for Singapore's aviation history. He added, through the stories in the exhibition, we hope visitors are able to appreciate how difficult and courageous the decision was back then and how impactful it is still for us today. Without Mr. Lee's vision, courage and conviction, there will be no Qingji Airport today.